YouTube, how are you guys doing? Assassin here, coming to you with a new video on how to optimize Windows 10 for gaming. These are the settings I currently run on my gaming rig, which is an 8350 at 4.7 GHz and a single 970. Pretty solid machine, 16 gigs of RAM. Alright, so first go into File Explorer. My File Explorer is right down there. Then go to this PC. You want to click on your main hard drive. Make sure it's a right click. Go to Properties. Go to Hardware. And then I have twin SSDs in here, so I will select the main SSD. Click Properties. Change Settings. Policies. And you want to click Turn Off Write Cache. At first it's going to be probably just like that, and then you want to go like that. And then go ahead and close out of that. You can do that on every hard drive in your system if you wish. I think I have already. I don't know. I shall look. Uh, looks like I have, honestly. I have a lot of hard drives in here. <laughs> Yep, I've actually gone through and already done that. So after that, you want to go just in the File Explorer window, not selected on anything. Just go like this, click on Properties. This will pull up this window, and here it says my system specs, 8350, 8-core, 4.7 gigahertz, 16 gigs RAM. Go to Advanced System Settings. Here, I clicked under Performance. Copy these settings down right here. I shall hold the frame right there for a second. Alrighty. Then go to advanced. Click change on the um, paging file. And then set no paging file on, well, on your main drive you want no paging file. I had a ma paging file enabled on one drive so I just disabled it. Um, then we'll say you need to restart, click OK, do that later. That's all for there. And then after that, download a program called CCleaner. I'll put a link in the description. Go to Registry, click Scan for Issues. Click Fix Selected Issues. Then go to Cleaner, click Run Cleaner. Close that. And then after that, you want to download a program called Samsung Magician. I'll put a link in the description. You want to go over to Rapid Mode if you have an SSD. Only do this if you have an SSD. You're not going to be able to if you have a normal hard drive. Select your main SSD. Click, in your case, it'll be Enable. Click Enable and then it'll do all the OK and all that. So that's that. And then after that, download a program called Malwarebytes Anti-Malware. That's the antivirus I currently run on my PC. I've never had any issues with that being problematic. Um, if you have an NVIDIA video card, open GeForce Experience. as it's loading here. It takes a little bit to load up. Alrighty. Then, as you see here, there's a driver. You want to click on the download button. I haven't updated my video card in a while, so that kind of makes sense. So, if there's any drivers in here, you want to make sure you download them and all that. Make sure you keep your PC up to date. So, while that's doing that, turns out I actually had a driver. I thought it was up to date. Um, shit, that was another thing I was going to have. Oh my goodness.
brain fart to the maximum here. And then if you have AMD card, go to AMD drivers in the search window. I haven't used AMD video cards in a long, long time. And then you want to select what type of card you have. And if you don't know what type of card you have, go like this. Um, and then there. Right now, I'm using a different... I'm using the um, stock video card in the PC because for some reason this report recording program does not like my 970. So it uses a stock video card. And it's not going to be able to update because it's fucked up. Which does not surprise me. Oops, I just clicked on that. <laughs> Oopsie. <laughs> I shall cut that out. Stupid big picture mode on Steam. Okay, I just... Oh my god. Stupid thing. <coughs> And then, that should be everything. I hope I helped you guys out on optimizing your PC for gaming, and...